Deep in the northern forest, where winter's icy grip can turn rivers into glass and silence the land in frozen stillness, there lives a creature that seems almost magical. A frog, small, ordinary at first glance, yet capable of surviving what would kill almost any other animal. This is the wood frog, the amphibian that can survive being frozen solid. When temperatures drop, most creatures have two options, flee the cold or perish in it. But the wood frog has mastered a third choice, enduring the freeze itself. Unlike bears that hibernate in cozy dens or birds that migrate south, the wood frog does something astonishing. It stops fighting the cold and lets winter consume it. As the frost creeps in, the frog's body begins to shut down, its heart stops beating, its lungs stop breathing, even its brain's electrical activity fades to silence. To the untrained eye, the animal appears dead. Yet this is not the end. It's the beginning of a remarkable survival strategy. The secret lies in chemistry. When ice crystals form inside the cells of most animals, they shred delicate tissues, puncturing membranes and killing the creature instantly. But the wood frog prepares for this deadly challenge. As soon as the first chill of autumn brushes its skin, the frog floods its bloodstream with glucose, ordinary sugar. This sugar acts like a natural antifreeze, not preventing the frog from freezing but protecting its cells from destruction. Instead of forming sharp, deadly crystals inside, ice gathers harmlessly in spaces between the cells. The frog's vital organs remain intact, cushioned in a sugary shield. For months the frog rests beneath leaves or shallow soil, locked in icy stasis. Temperatures plunge well below freezing, yet the frog does not decay. It does not breathe. It does not eat. It simply waits, perfectly preserved by nature's chemistry. Then, when spring sunlight warms the forest and the ice begins to melt, something extraordinary happens. The frog stirs, its heart shudders back to life, its lungs gasp air once again. Within hours the animal that seemed dead is hopping among puddles as if nothing happened, a frozen statue reborn into a living, breathing creature. This survival trick is not just a marvel of evolution, it carries lessons for science. Researchers study the wood frog to unlock secrets of cryopreservation, how to store human organs for transplant, how to preserve blood supplies, even how to prepare astronauts for deep space travel. Imagine if humans like the frog could endure freezing without damage, long journeys, medical emergencies, even suspended animation might be possible. And yet, the wood frog asks for nothing in return. Each spring it resumes its ordinary life, calling for mates, laying eggs in ponds, feeding on insects. To the casual observer it is just another frog among many. But hidden within its humble body is one of nature's most powerful survival stories. A creature that dies each winter, only to rise again when the world thaws. So the next time you hear a chorus of frogs after the snow melts, remember, some of those voices belong to animals that spent the winter as ice sculptures, silent and still. They are living reminders that in nature, survival is not always about strength or speed. Sometimes it is about surrendering to the elements and trusting the power of adaptation. The wood frog does not fight winter, it becomes part of it. Frozen solid, heart still, body stiff. And yet when spring comes, life flows back into its veins. In this fragile, resilient amphibian we find a lesson in endurance, rebirth and the astonishing possibilities of life itself.